my friends, and welcome back to The Long Dark on our Stalker Run. This is episode 16 on our quest to survive for 500 days. Uh, let's go ahead and resume our game. Okay, when last we left off, we were here in the camp office. Safe and sound, we got uh, lots of loot here. In fact, we are probably pretty heavy. Well, let's, let's take a look at our inventory situation. Oh, you know what, guys? I think when we left off, we were just ready to set out, weren't we? So we probably don't need to waste any time uh, getting things set up. We'll probably just head out for the dam. Let me just make sure there's nothing else we could possibly drop because we're going to find so much gear as we are exploring the dam. Uh, I almost wonder if I should drop some of these matches. I mean, it's only 0.1 kilograms, but every little bit is going to help us. You know, one thing I think I... Let's see, is that... Yeah, we've already used three hours of this book, so I think I do want to switch books. We'll swap with one of the other books, because we are likely going to be gone a long time. And I would rather have a fresh book to give us plenty of reading opportunities. So let's drop this. And we're going to use... Uh, let's use the uh, archery. We'll take the archery book with us. I'm not even going to look at the other loot because then I'll want to pick stuff up. Yeah, we do. We've got a little bit of food. I'm not even. Uh, I'm not going to look at it because I don't want to take it. Okay, let's see what else we can drop, if anything. Yeah, you know I'm going to drop these. I'm probably going to find lots more matches. Put those here. Um, anything else? Do you have the coal? Ah, you know, I hate to do this, but I think we're actually doing pretty good for warmth because it's the the stalker run tends to keep us a little bit warmer. We do have warmer clothing. I'm gonna leave. Uh, let's leave five coal. Hope I don't regret that. Uh, you know, I'll take one more. I I, I want to have at least three. Let's have three. Okay. Medical situation's looking pretty good. Yeah. Do I want to drop the energy drink? 0.25 kilograms, I'm going to drop it. Hopefully we'll find more. Uh, we'll probably find some coffee. Although I think we do. Do we have coffee? We do. We got some coffee. We could brew up. Uh, clothing is looking pretty good. Of course, we got the food situation. Um, okay, here's where we can lose some weight. We don't need all of this. Or do we? That gun. Oh man, 4.2 kilograms. And I think we do have the bow, right? Yeah, we got the bow. Oh, 39% though. Okay, so either we bring the bow or the rifle. I don't think we need both. The bow is so nice for the ptarmigan. I just wish it wasn't in 39% condition. You know, I think... Did we have another bow? It seemed like we had a better quality bow around here. Let me just see what the condition is up here. I might just leave the rifle, guys. We might leave the rifle behind. This is our bow. Okay, 81%. Um, how many arrows do we have? Okay, so we got four decent arrows. Um, and we don't have any fire-hardened arrows, unfortunately. Okay, so let's... I think I'm going to leave the rifle here, guys. I hope I'm not making a bad judgment here. Leave the rifle. Leave the rifle rounds. And then, oh, oh man, do we have, um, do we have arrow shafts? I thought we had some. Okay, so we're going to drop the lower quality bow as well. Okay, we'll leave those here. And then I think I did have some arrow shafts. Where 
Where where did I put the arrow shafts? I don't know. I don't see them. Hmm. How heavy are the guns? The uh, revolvers. 1.5 kilograms. Okay, so that's a lot better. If I did bring another gun, because this one well, was uh, 4.2. Yeah, it's just so heavy. Um, do we have the other revolver with us? Or did I drop that already too? Where did I put the other revolver? Is it here? Like right out in the open? There it is. I know better than to leave revolvers like on the ground. Let's have a look at this. Condition 64, it's 1.56 kilograms. Let's take it. Uh, I don't have any rounds in there though, currently. Okay, so how many revolver rounds uh, do we have? Six and six, okay. I think I'm just gonna go guys. We got the bow. If we have to deal with big game, I do have a revolver. Lost a little bit of weight in the process of doing that. Let's check what the weather's like. You know, first I gotta I gotta load this revolver. It, oh it is it is loaded. Okay. Alright, well let's get down low. Appears to be clear weather. Early morning still. We are nice and warm. Oh, it would be nice if we had some cooked meat out here. But I think we're just going to set off. Um, do I have some torches? I do have four torches. I'm going to try to uh, try to avoid the wolves. But guys, we're just going to set off. We're going to go for it. Let's make our way to the dam. And that is like uh, loot heaven. The dam is going to be so full of loot. We're not going to be able to carry it all. So have to pick and choose what we're going to take with us. I got to remember, next time we get a fire started, we do need to make some fire hardened arrows. In case we come across some ptarmigan. Hopefully the weather holds up for us. You can hear the wolves up ahead. So guys, I apologize for the gap between episodes. It's been a while. And I uh, do appreciate you guys. Uh, one user in particular. Thank you so much for commenting and kind of checking in with me. I, I do appreciate it. You guys... Uh, I, get, I get a lot of... Uh, meaning from the comments you guys leave a lot of value and uh, I do appreciate it I got a comment recently from a user uh, Meller Judith uh, I hope I I hope I'm pronouncing your name username correctly um, you know just kind of checking in with me because it's been a while since I posted a video and I just really appreciate uh, the community you know the long dark community just a great great That's community to uh, to uh, hang out in, post videos in. You guys are awesome. Okay, got more ammunition and a gun, a, a gun book. We'll probably drop all this at the trailer. Another flare, okay. Okay, this weather is not going to be helping us at all. Oh, you know what? I can tell our frame rates are kind of down. I, and I just realized I haven't plugged in the laptop, so I'll be right back. Okay, that is way better. Let's 
take it. Matches? Nice. Okay, I gotta get rid of this torch because I don't, I don't think it would help us if the uh, if we saw a wolf. I've got a deer. I'm not gonna click on the deer in case we need it later on. All right, let's just keep going. I do want to grab some sticks just so I can make some fire hardened arrows if we do get a fire going. I don't need a lot of them. I think I was it like four maybe. We already had three. We still have a lot of exploration to do on this map. I've really uh, bypassed a lot of good loot, good locations to search. Another possible moose spawn. And uh, I'd actually considered staying here longer in Mystery Lake. Oh, it looks like moose markings on that tree up ahead. I didn't actually know we could get a moose uh, in this area. That is that is moose markings, right? On that tree, right in the center of our screen. Oh man, I, d I didn't want to use a flare to get by these guys, but I think we might have to. Yeah, we've got a bunch of wolves. Here we go. Okay, we're not heavy. They really should leave us alone. Except that wind is slowing us down. Go say hello to this wolf. As long as we've got that wolf telling us, I think uh, the other ones will leave us alone. Don't think they can come in here, but I'll, I'll close that just in case. Hope we look around. Got a lot of, well, not a lot. We do have we have uh, clothing we can't use right there. Looks like that's about it. All right, wolves. Um, There's a logging camp down there, but we're just going to keep pressing on to the uh, to the dam. Might have to scare this wolf away. Let's just get rid of him. Got moose markings. So there must be the potential for a moose around here, although I've never seen it. Didn't even know you could get a moose here. One regret I, I have, I think I started to say this, but I got distracted. Um, I'd actually considered sticking around here in uh, Mystery Lake. Because of the moose, the moose skin we have curing, would be nice to have the moose hide satchel before we head out and try to loot all the other locations. So we are pretty much just going on one great big looting circle. We're going to go through the dam, lots of loot here, and then I'd like to head up to Ash Canyon, and we'll get the uh, hopefully get up to the gold mine there. Lots of good loot up that way. And then, you know, we may as well swing up to the, the plane wreck. 
at the top of Timberwolf Mountain. And you know that is going to be so much loot. And knowing me, I would like to bring that loot down at least to the uh, that cabin at the bottom at the base of, of uh, Timberwolf Mountain. Sorry guys, I'm having trouble talking because I'm also looking for the, the moose. I see markings right there on that tree as well. I was just wondering if I could actually see the moose. I don't know if he comes over here. Okay, Carter Hydroelectric Dam. I think first thing before we head in there, we do want to check out the trailers, drop off any loot we picked up. May as well check out the truck. Hey, we've got a battery. It's getting too heavy to carry. Okay, got some goodies here. Nice. And we got a note. New cave has opened up to Milton near the old trapper's place. Earthquake. Hey, that I think that's where we've already been. That's the connect, uh, connecting cave to Milton, right? I think, or no, to, uh, what's that, Mountain Town? All right, we'll check in here. Trailer, Mystery Lake. Um, it should be light enough to loot. Hopefully you guys can see okay. I think I can use this. Um, normally I do like to light the lantern to help you guys uh, see a little better. But if I remember, I think we're actually kind of low on lantern oil. Let's see what our lantern situation is like. Oh no, we're actually full. Okay, good. We're going to need that as we go through the, uh, the dam. We're going to need all that lamp oil. Okay, I guess, sorry, I guess I already checked that one. So we'll put this over here. Sometimes I think they put loot like kind of hard places to get like that. Okay. Coffee, nice. Take it. Okay, um head out. Let me get down low here. Okay, that wolf is around here somewhere. Let's head in this trailer, do a little bit of looting. I always forget to check these. This will come in handy. Another book. Let's see if there's anything under the bed. Okay, we got some socks. Grab those. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Fashion parka. Well, I'm going to move it over here. A 
this stuff will come in handy. Okay. Make a little bit of a pile, I guess, of all the, the loot. So we got more matches. Uh, we'll drop those. Okay, we picked up another book. Could drop that. And we don't need all these pain pills. I'm still hoping to get another pair of long johns. Be nice to have those. I've uh, got lots of food. Let's go ahead and drink up a soda. And then I might hang on to the peaches to cook them. Let's drop. Um, you know, I'm going to eat these. Drop these. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Herbal tea, eight herbal tea, 0 0.08 kilograms. You know, it's really not very heavy at all. Just carry it with us. Okay, anything else we picked up here? I'm gonna drop six of these. Let's do 10. So we are right next to what I call the grocery store. Uh, which is the, what is that area? Ravine? Right next to us is the ravine. And the ravine has so many resources. This is kind of a nice dropping off point, leaving this gear here. Just get orchid. Um, get everything organized a little bit before we head over to the, the dam. Okay, let's go check out the dam. Hopefully the wolf's not right out here. Okay, that's the way to the grocery store, but we are going to head through the dam. I can see the wolf over there. Alright, let's just make sure we shut the gate behind us. Okay, now I think there can be a wolf in here. I don't think I've ever actually encountered one. I'm going to try to be a little bit cautious. Let's check the body over here, see if there's any loot. I'll take it. T shirt. Okay, let's head inside. Welcome to the Carter Hydroelectric Dam, everybody. Hey, nice. That's a good sign that we're going to get some good loot, I think. Already we got some bullets. Let's put away our torch and our flare. We'll head inside. Okay. Let the looting begin. Although it is pretty dark. Um, this is where we definitely need the lantern. All 
Alright, let's hope for some good loot. Oh, I guess that doesn't open. Okay. Okay, I'm really hoping to get a rifle cleaning kit. Maybe multiple rifle cleaning kits or gun cleaning kits. We've got that really nice revolver back at the camp office. That uh, I'd like to get that in good working condition. I think it was at like 32% or something. But so far in this game, we haven't come across a single gun cleaning kit. Hey, I got another lantern. Uh, let's see what condition this is in. Well, this stuff will come in handy. 99%. Ooh, that's great. I think the lantern we have is probably already pretty high. I'll have to check later. We can see what condition it's in. A rifle round. This will come in handy. Hey, nice. That'll help us get our looting done. Can we open any of these? No. Okay. I think we'll just hang to the left. Although, you know, I do... I often forget to search this, so I'm going to search this first. This center island. Let's see what's in here. Okay, nice. Grape soda. Yeah, I'll take it for now. I guess this is the place to come if you need scrap metal. There's probably going to be lots of scrap metal here. Cherry can with uh, 3.6 liters. Okay, don't want to miss anything, but I do kind of want to go fast. Um, let's see. Okay, did we... So we came from here. Search there. Let's keep going this way. the most uh, useful item will be that we find. Okay, we'll wait to go down there. Let's see what's here. Got a flare. And you know, I always forget to check these. So I'm going to check this first. I'll take it. Bandage and water purification. Candy bar. Just making sure I don't miss anything on the walls. I forgot there's a safe here. Okay, I'm gonna put our lantern out. Save on fuel. Wow, okay. Ha, huh, 50, what was that, like 58? Okay, 58, 21, I think. Fifty-eight. Twenty-one. Oh, fifty-eight, twenty-one, thirty-four. Fifty-eight, 
21. 34. Give us something good. Uh, super heavy boots. And nice boots. Ooh, mucklucks. Okay, that was pretty good. I think those mucklucks are going to be really good. Let's check them out. So currently our trail boots, they weigh uh, one kilogram. And we got a negative three on the speed. But we'd get almost a one Celsius degree of warmth. Let's just not even look at those. So these are also negative three. They weigh a half kilogram more, and they're almost two degrees of warmth. If we get these fixed up, they're going to be actually probably really warm. So I think these might be possibly the best boots in the game, or maybe the deerskin ones are better. I don't know. But these are so good. And they look cool. You know, I, I think they look, uh, they look really cool. I have a poster, an old, like, 1970s poster of the Lord of the Rings, and, like, uh, illustrated poster, movie poster or something like that, or book poster. And Gandalf is wearing some boots just like these. They look pretty cool. So I, I've always kind of liked the way those look. The big laces on them. Okay, let's get our lantern out. Okay, anything hidden back here? You know, let's take a look at this production area, or the, uh, I guess this would be the generator area. Let's see if we put our lamp down. Does that make any difference? It's pretty dark in there. Looks like we're getting a bit thirsty. Maybe I should get a drink here. Got some books. I'm gonna drop these by the entrance. Okay. I think I can use this. Yeah, we'll take those. Some more tools. I'd eat snow if the hypothermia wouldn't kill me. You know, she's really not that hungry. I wonder why she's saying that. And, you know, honestly, we could go a long time without water because our health is so good. If we wanted to, we could just, you know, go without water and then drink up before we sleep. Okay, did we get everything in here? I think we did. Where well, that big jerry can of oil is going to come in handy as we're searching. It does get pretty dark here. Oh man, I love these posters. Travel posters for Mystery Lake. I would hang up a poster like that if I had one. Coastal Highway. It's not my favorite, the uh, poster. I mean, that's cool. I like the Mystery Lake one. I think they have some other ones throughout the game. May as well drink. She deserves it. No sense making her suffer when we have all this loot. I 
Whenever I come in here, I really try to be quiet because there is a guy. He's just kind of hiding out here. I think he's waiting for the quiet apocalypse to pass. He's kind of spending his time in there. Give him, give him his privacy. Okay, we got more boots. I will take them just to drop them up at the, up at the entrance. Take that. Take all this. Trash potato. Nice. Try to be quiet. Okay, we are getting a bit heavy. Okay, there's the stairs. Um, might want to drop off some of this stuff before we go to the other floor. Okay, we made our circle here, our rounds. Let's drop off some of this stuff. Okay, we don't need the books. Got a lot of water purification tablets. Got lots of clothing, didn't we? Yeah, we got the shoes, that's right. Got lots of water. I'm gonna step over here. Drop the water. And the trash potato. Let's leave this here as well for now. Uh, you know, I'll drop that too. Okay, we've got lots of flares. Drop those, and those. And we should be good now. Let's keep going. Oh, you know what? I should drop the oil too. Um, let's put this out and refuel our lantern. So our lantern is at 100%. Okay, good. So we got the best lantern. I would like to find the red, rare lantern that's out there somewhere. We'll keep this and I'll use that to refuel next time. I think we've got a little bit of water leaking from the roof there. Okay, let's continue. Uh, stairs, that's right. Let's go check the top of the stairs. I think the door's locked up here. If we go all the way to the top. Okay, the door's locked. Hope nobody needs this anymore. I'll take it for now. Anything useful here? Got water. I could use this. I will take it. I should check what time it is, because I do not want to be in here when the aurora hits. The sun's going down. Yeah, I don't want to get trapped in the dam.
course, we could just sleep, right? If the Aurora comes. Okay, I already searched those. Check these lockers. Kind of hoping for a stim there. leave off over here okay we'll check in there in just a minute make sure I didn't miss anything okay let's go inside Hear the dam creaking. See, uh, freezing and thawing, creaking, rusting, ambience. Is there anything on here? Got a book? I imagine this would be a very kind of this stuff freaky. This would be kind of a freaky place to explore in the current conditions. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll leave it up at the entrance. What do you think this award is for? So he's into fishing. Maybe it's like a Dundee award, Dunder Mifflin. Wonder what kind of office politics they had here before things went to, to the apocalypse. Okay, uh, I think we've searched everything here. Aid station, yeah, we checked that, it's empty. There's absolutely nothing in the aid station today. Okay, um, is there anything at the bottom of the stairs? I don't remember. Oh, we got some rounds. Okay, rifle cartridges. Alright, let's head back. Okay, let's drop some of this stuff. 
lots of books. Let's see, I do want to drop one of these. Let's drop the shooting guide. Is there anything we need to drop here? Oh, the metal. Okay. Well, so far, no aurora, which is good. Problem is all these wires that are on the ground throughout the dam. Hopefully we can make it through the dam without the aurora kicking in. Uh, but if it does, you know, I think I'll just lay down and sleep. So let's carry on. Do we want to refill the lantern while we're here? Maybe I will, because we got this huge jerry can. Okay. I want to make sure you guys can see what's going on. Okay, so up ahead we got the admin office, turbine room, control room, and restroom. It's time to head downstairs. Okay, there's often a dead guy here. Hey, look at that. Got a stim. I'll take it. Yeah. That's awesome. Sometimes sometimes there's a dead guy here, and even when he's not here, you can like click on his body. Invisible body. Um Do we want the can opener? I'll take it. Yeah, I could hear her stomach growling. Okay, we got the turbine room. It's always quite impressive. Now, where are we gonna start? Okay, there's the wires I'm worried about. Can we get through, can we get over this? Yeah. Ooh, what's that? Rifle cartridge. I think I can use this. Okay. Um, before I go upstairs, I want to just search. Uh, try to search the whole floor. Let's head upstairs. Okay, I don't really want to break down any crates right now. Is there anything we can see or reach back here? No. Okay. Let's 
We got some kind of loot hovering right there. Okay, so... How do we get up there? We got that rope climb, or I think we can... I think we can take some stairs, maybe on the other side. There's a control room that we already searched. Let's head across the catwalk here. Peaches, that's what was hovering. We'll take it. Okay, I think that's just about it for this level. Oop, got a little bit of lag there. Um, I gotta go back across, don't I? Ooh, hey, look at this. Fire this striker. Handy. Nice, I totally missed that. You know, it'd be nice if I could climb through the window or something right here. And just leave all of our loot over by the entrance. Okay, I think we need to find the... Uh, there's like some really big heavy door. Yeah, that's it over there. Okay, we've got to get over there. Got an arrow. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Broken arrow. I hope nobody needs that as well. So we actually need it. Okay, got another arrow. Another lantern. Uh, Sixty-eight percent. Uh, yeah, I'll take it. I'm not sure I can carry much more. We'll leave it by the exit. anything in the microwave? No. So this stuff will come in handy. Nice. If you've played the game Oblivion, then you know how valuable paintbrushes are. There's like a hack you can use with paintbrushes. Metal box. Uh, I think Oblivion is one of my favorite games. I really enjoyed that game. 
It's the uh, predecessor to Skyrim. If you've heard of Skyrim. One funny thing about the game Oblivion is uh, the artificial intelligence they use for the, the NPC characters is pretty hilarious. The characters will actually just walk around and talk to each other. And uh, you can kind of eavesdrop on their conversations. They're pretty hilarious. Like unintentionally hilarious. Like the way they were programmed to interact. They just have the most random interactions. Okay, did I miss anything? Oh, yep, there's a book I'll right there. It. Definitely want that. Oh man, I already checked this. Okay. So, um, our exit is actually right over here. Uh, just looking around a bit. Okay, exit is over here. So, I'm going to drop the extra lantern here. Okay, we could drop the flare, extra flare, drop the can opener. Wait, do we only have one can opener? Oh well, we don't we don't need any can openers, I guess. We got plenty of tin cans. Um what else do we pick up? I don't want a blue flare. Picked up rifle ammunition. That is really handy. I'd like you know, I should probably hang on to this until we get to a, a prominent place to drop it somewhere where we're actually gonna find it and use it. Okay, we got the extra extra lantern. We'll drop that. Okay, what else do we pick up? I picked up a bunch of junk. Firewood. Uh, fire striker's uh, pretty handy. We'll save that. Do we pick up clothing? Yeah, I got some clothing items. Um. We got snow pants and combat pants. We can drop these jeans. Drop the light shell. I mean, ideally, I'd like to drop these by the front entrance of the dam instead of here. Because we actually can't come back in through this door. Um, but I think it's probably good just to keep moving. So we'll drop it here for now. And I think we're good now. So let's go to the lower portion of the dam. I need to find a place to rest. There's some more wires. So we might get stuck over here, maybe. 85% hunting knife, and can't open that. I'm kind of pushing my luck exploring at night. What is up here? Is there any loot? Don't think so. Anything over here? There's lots of wires. Okay, getting pretty close to the end here. I think I can use this. Yeah, we'll take that. keep a whetstone at my work, actually. I, I, I really enjoy sharpening my knife. Uh, I use my knife at work all the time, so. It's uh, really relaxing, kind of meditative. Got some scrap metal. OK, 
Okay, saw some lantern fuel here. Definitely not hurting for loot. But I hope it wasn't a mistake leaving our rifle back behind at the uh, camp office. I should probably leave a note that that's where it is. Yeah, we'll take that. Um, let's see. I want to leave a note about the rifle. Let me just find a stopping point here. Okay, right before we go down here, let's. Uh, I'm going to put out the lantern. And let's leave a note. I would drink almost anything about now. Okay, so Mystery Lake, Trapper's Cabin. All right, we're gonna add one for the camp office. Hunting rifle, and we had that kind of rare, um, unique uh, revolver. I want to fix that up if we can, and we also had just lots of loot. can't think of anything else really we need to say about the camp office. Okay, let's get out our lantern. We're almost done here. Look how much uh, lamp oil we've used just exploring. I'm glad we refilled it. Sure, we get some food. Don't want to lose our well fed bonus. Find a stopping point here, we'll get some food. Tools. This will come in handy. Yeah, that is that is nice. We left our other tools back at the camp office. Oh yeah, I should probably put that on the list. It's not that big of a deal though. Okay, well guys, as I have been searching, I'm curious if you saw stuff that I missed. It's very likely I missed something. Hopefully it's nothing big. We still have not found a rifle cleaning kit. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Okay, and there is the entrance, guys. That is how we get back in here, if we have to come back this way. Uh, it's a one-way entrance, though. I can't go, can't go out that way. Well, this stuff will come in handy. Well, we did get, uh, we got the stim. That was a really good find. 
Trying to think what else we found. We, we got that jerry can. That was good. Jerry can full of oil. Sounds like quite the storm outside. Man, our oil is just about gone. Crackers! Nice! That is a treasure. Actually, is really good. Did I already check those? Yeah, I did. I can see you're thirsty, Astrid. We'll get you a drink here pretty quick. I'll take it. There's no shortage of matches, that's for sure. Where? Our, our uh, lantern fuel is just about out there. More matches. Everything back here. All right, got another pot. Use this. And a sewing kit. Nice. Oh, we got the key. Oh, nice. What do we have here? MREs. Holy cow. I didn't realize we had the key to that. I was just about to say, oh, we got to find the key. Um, that's great. MREs, they're super heavy, but they do fill you up for sure. Okay, I think with that, we are done looting the dam. Need to refuel this. Okay, all right, all right. Let's put out our lantern. Uh, first thing, I am going to refuel it so I don't forget. Okay, now let's get some food. Uh, let's, eat, let's eat an MRE. They're so heavy. Look at that, guys. It filled us almost completely up. It's one MRE. Those things are amazing. Um, energy bars. Uh, let's see if that can top us off. It's, like, it's just about right. Just have 0.02 left. I'm just gonna drop it. It's really not worth carrying. Okay, now we do have a ton of water, so let's get some, get a drink here. And since we don't have an Aurora, I'm going to try to push on. We'll get back up to the exit. is kind of nice. We didn't get the Aurora uh, to slow us down during our searching. And it is pretty late. Time to sleep. Let's head up and put our bedroll down, sleep for the night. In the morning we're going to exit the dam and uh, make our way through the cave system to uh, Pleasant Valley. And then it's just a short walk, well, kind of a long walk from the exit of the cave in Pleasant Valley all the way up to the rope climb to Timberwolf Mountain. Then quite a quite an exploration getting to. Well, actually, it's not it's not that far. Once we're in Timberwolf Mountain, um, wait, did I pass? Uh, I did pass it, guys. <laughs> I was so busy talking. I think we passed our exit. Um, from Timberwolf Mountain, it should be uh, real easy to get into Ash Canyon. And then, uh, got to make our way up to the gold mine. And then we'll get the tactical backpack. So, oh wait. 
I'm so turned around. I'm sorry, guys. My brain can only handle like two things, maybe three at the same time. And I get all kind of jumbled up. So we got to go this way. And then what up the stairs. And then I think we've got our exit. Sorry about that. Just looking forward to getting to the gold mine, getting that tactical backpack, and making our way up to the, uh, the airplane wreck. It's going to be so much loot up there. I mean, that's really going to be the good stuff. I, I'm like 99% sure we'll find a rifle cleaning kit up there. There's got to be a rifle cleaning kit in those uh, those uh, cargo bins, you know. All right, let's go ahead and put this out. We're already good for food. Let's get it. Let's just top up our water. And I think I want to sleep the whole 12 hours. What do you think? Um, that's going to put us, what, like right at noon, I think? So we should be fine to sleep 12 hours. Be nice and well rested. We've got plenty of calories. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, nice. Good morning, everybody. Let's get a drink. All right, uh, let's pick up our bedroll. And guys, I think this is actually going to be where we call it an episode. Right before we head out the door. So you already know what's coming in the next few episodes. So I hope you'll come along with me. I do want to say thanks, guys, for, for uh, coming all this way so far. Appreciate your encouragement and uh, feedback and... Even if you just leave a thumbs up, I, I do appreciate it. It would really help out the channel. I am trying to grow the channel. So guys, I won't say too much more. Just uh, hope you come along for the next episode. And I hope to catch you as we continue our adventure. Thanks for coming along, guys. Take care.